and welcome to The Fresh Life. I'm 13 on your side, health reporter Val Lego, bringing you a fresh take on healthy living. Now we've been sitting around working from home for a year. Are you noticing anything? Has your butt gone numb? Or do you have hip or lower back pain? Then you might have dead butt syndrome. Yes, it is actually a thing. So I brought in my good friend, Dr. K from Metro Health Sports Medicine Clinic to help us out. So Dr. K, what is dead butt syndrome? Yeah, you're right, it's a real thing. And it affects people who sit a lot and it also affects run. And, uh, and I do a little bit of both, so it affects me as well. And basically, there's three glute muscles and the middle one called the glute medius starts not to work so well. And it's a problem because when we're running, stand on the, like our right leg, it'll, t it'll tilt to the left. If we stand on our left leg, it'll tilt to the right. And that'll throw us off when we walk around. And is it a permanent thing? Like once you have dead butt syndrome, is that it? You've got it? No, the good news is that you can get that glute medius to fire again. Um, it, it, it goes to sleep a little bit, um, but it isn't completely dead, but it does go to sleep and wake it up. And so what is your recommendation of how we can get rid of dead bed syndrome? There are a few stretches and strengthening exercises you can do um, that are similar to lunges. They're a little side and, and a band that you can around your ankles and, and, uh, and walk sideways with. I always tell people just Google you know, dead butt syndrome exercise, but you'll find four or five or six exercises that are easy to incorporate into your day to get that glute muscle tired. And before you know it, you won't have dead butt syndrome anymore. Basically what you're saying is you have to get off your rot and get moving. <laughs> All right, Absolutely. thanks so much, Dr. K for stopping in to see us. Now I get it, you've been sitting for a year, so working out can seem like a big ask. So why not start with walking? It has great health benefits like weight loss, muscle building, and can lower blood pressure and cholesterol. I've got a walking workout for you to try that is all the rage on TikTok right now. These are health trends that actually work part two. It's one of the 12, 330 workout. You set your treadmill to an incline of 12 and to a speed of three miles per hour. And then you simply walk for 30 minutes. Sounds easy, but that 12 incline gets hard fast. This workout is great for Liz, which is basically the fat burning sweet spot. This method was created by Lauren Geraldo, but has quickly taken over TikTok. Some say they've lost 10 pounds in just a month. So here's a recap. Incline of 12, walking pace of three miles per hour for 30 minutes a day, five days a week. Now when I started doing this, it is hard at first, but it quickly gets easier and I really love it. So if I've convinced you to make walking a new habit, then you may want to be sure to use good form. So here's how. Roll your foot heel to toe, keep your feet hip width apart, engage your core by pulling your stomach in and press your shoulders back and down. And remember to look forward. Hey, before we go, I need to answer our viewer Bob's question. He asked me if, your toast, if toasting your bread reduces the amount of sugar in the bread. The answer is yes. It does lower the glycemic index, so it's less likely than regular bread to spike the blood sugar, but it does not lower the calorie count. So don't expect to see a difference in your waistline by toasting your bread. I love hearing from you and answer your questions. So if you've got one, send it to ValLego at 13onyourside.com and I'll give you the answer right here on The Fresh Life. Well, we're out of time for now. Next week on The Fresh Life, I'll tell you why eating lavender is good for your health. Thanks so much for joining me. You can catch a new episode of The Fresh Life every Sunday at noon right here on 13 On Your Side's YouTube channel. Until then, keep it healthy, keep it fresh.